look at how Uganda Free Zone Authority is creating these opportunities. And uh, in Uganda Free Zone Authority is the government agency that regulates and licenses at least export processing zones and free port zones for the purpose of creating opportunities for export oriented investments and also job creation. Take a look at this, we return. Uganda Free Zones Authority is a government agency that is largely mandated to create opportunities for export-oriented investment and job creation. Our mandate is derived from the Free Zones Act of 2014 and uh, we basically regulate and license companies that manufacture, add value, process, reconfigure goods and provide services to boost the export uh, of this country. Doreen Kambabazi, the public relations officer of the Uganda Free Zone Authority, reveals that it's important for us to compete favorably by investing in machines instead of looking at only exporting raw agricultural products, which in turn are imported back into the country at a high price. There is so much that we have in our country, so much that can be added onto value. But I think we go for the soft, uh, easy road of let us uh, export the raw material and uh, benefit very quickly. People are exporting coffee seeds, people are exporting raw cotton, maize seed, but think about the more money that one would be able to make if they were able to process and package and export it. Because you see, what we export out of this country uh, in raw form, they bring it back to us at an even higher cost. So I think for me it is to say that let Ugandans open up to machines. The money that is being put in these very many arcades that are mushrooming, if that money was put in machines, as a country would be able to move further. And government is deliberate on giving tax incentives that enable manufacturers to produce at lower cost to be able to compete favorably in the globe. She adds that the African continental free trade area gives an opportunity for Ugandan manufacturers since it provides huge market for Ugandan products and so we have to be ready to benefit rather than looking at opening only free markets for the African countries. The Africa continental free trade area is a huge opportunity for Uganda because now we are playing with the big boys as we are talking about South Africa you're talking about Nigeria you're talking about uh, North Africa all those countries have already developed in terms of manufacturing and producing more to, to, to put out as export now this is a market that is coming to Uganda we are saying that now uh, you're having a much bigger market for Ugandan goods and so for us now as a country, we should be preparing ourselves to produce enough to be able to supply and play in that big game in the league of the African continental free trade area. Otherwise, Uganda is going to become a supermarket because now they are breaking all the barriers. And so for you as a country, for us as a country, as Uganda, how ready are we to play on in that game? Bigger market, wider opportunities, because now someone from Uganda is able to go and uh, establish a factory in say, Zambia with no restrictions per se. So how are our people, our manufacturers, the Ugandans, how are we ready to play with that um, bigger opportunity that has been presented by the markets and, and, uh, and uh, available space in the whole continent. So that is uh, where I think that actually the free, zones the free zones present a better opportunity for Ugandans. And you see the problem is that most times we play victim. Most Ugandans say, no, you see government is only doing this for the foreigners. We are saying this is available for even Ugandans. In fact, government has said that um, for a foreigner to get 10-year tax holiday, they must be investing $50 million for you to get a developer's license in a free zone. But a Uganda only needs to invest $10 million. 
So already there is that preferential treatment for Ugandans. And so let us stop playing victim and let us invest so that we are able to reap more from our own country. Free zones are designated areas in Uganda where duty-free goods are stored, manufactured and, and processed for export. All domestic and foreign investors who export 80% and more of their enterprise output are eligible to invest in free zones.